65% of the human body is oxygen. It is the basic need of human life on Earth to survive. COVID-19 hampers the supply of oxygen in various parts of the body in severe patients. And hence, they require medical oxygen. But what is medical oxygen? How is it made? How is it supplied? Know it all in this video. In its most common form, oxygen is a colorless gas found in air and makes up 21% of our atmosphere. 78% is nitrogen and the remaining 1% is other gases. Oxygen is a lifeline of humans and animals. But this life-sustaining gas is also used in many industrial and scientific applications. But medical oxygen is different. It is high-purity oxygen that is used for medical treatments and is developed to use in the human body. In the present times, medical oxygen is indeed the need of the hour. There are several methods to produce medical oxygen. The most common commercial method is the separation of air in an air separation unit or ASU. ASUs are the plants that treat large volumes of gas from a few hundred tons to 20,000 tons per day. ASUs use a method called the fractional distillation method to produce pure oxygen. In this, the gases from the air are separated into various components after cooling it into a liquid state, then extracting liquid oxygen from it. The air is first cooled to minus 181 degree Celsius. At this temperature, the oxygen liquefies. The boiling point of nitrogen is 196 degree Celsius, so it still remains in gaseous form at this temperature. But argon has a similar boiling point to that of oxygen, which is minus 186 degrees Celsius. And so, a significant amount of argon liquefies with the oxygen. This liquid mixture of oxygen and argon is drained, decompressed and passed through a second low-pressure distillation column in order to separate. The final purified liquid oxygen is then transported using cryogenic containers. Cryogenic containers are highly insulating containers in which liquid gases are stored at a very cool temperature. Hospitals can also opt for on-site generation of oxygen by using the pressure swing adsorption technique, also known as PSA. In this method, oxygen is produced from the air by concentrating it. Producing oxygen near the hospital is an advantage as there is no transport involved and it can provide more oxygen than the hospital can secure with cylinders. There are portable oxygen generators as well, known as oxygen concentrators. These can be used at home. In this, the air is compressed using compressors and then sent to sieve beds. In sieve beds, there is a compound called zeolite which separates the nitrogen from oxygen. This leads to the generation of pure oxygen and the resultant air is 90 to 95% pure. That's all in this video. If you have any topic related to COVID-19, do let us know in the comments section. Till then, stay vigilant and healthy.